question that uh, if I have free time, uh, I want to use it to, uh, you know, go over to a school and visit kids or get into a hospital and uh, brighten up someone who's uh, battling a tough time in their life and, and their family or, uh, you know, going out on a baseball field and playing catch with a little leaguer and uh, giving them a memory that they can talk about for the rest of their life. You guys ready to get some glasses? You guys ready to get some glasses? I think we're good. I think it's mixed up here. Yeah. Serving lunches to these fine folks here. You know, are in need and we're down here helping out the community. You go. There you go. Enjoy. I want to thank you guys all from the bottom of my heart for everything you do, for everything you sacrifice, for serving our country, fighting for our freedoms. Um, because of everything that you've done, I get to call this place right here my workplace, my home, my playground to come in here and help lift these kids up there going through some tough times, obviously being in the hospital, not where they want to be, and to take their mind off that stuff just for a little bit. That is awesome, dude. Thank you. What's that, too? I brought these uh, blank, all-white Adidas cleats into the hospital for these kids to decorate or design uh, for me to wear. You know, I'm just trying to do my part and take advantage of the platform that us major league baseball players are giving continue to grow and, and get better and, and find more ways to get out there and, and make an impact in, in people's lives and our community. Wow. First of all, let me say I'm very honored to be here today with you guys on this special day, this important day. Um, I want to tip my hat to you guys for enlisting, for the three of you for re-enlisting. Uh, such an honorable act. I'm so happy to be here to, to uh, celebrate and, and congratulate you on this moment in your life. Uh, I'd like to give a huge round of applause to your families. They're sitting back here for the support that they've given all of you uh, to be able to take this big step in, in your life and in your journey. So family, thank you guys so much for allowing your sons and daughters and brothers and sisters to make this commitment and honor and courage and fight for our freedoms and everything that we believe in. Um, I can't say enough about the commitment you guys are making today. It's, it's truly special. Um, high performance isn't specific to just being on a baseball field or, or being on a sports field or arena or in a stadium. Uh, attaining a high level goal or performance can happen in combat, academics, life management, uh, all the same determination, discipline, teamwork, and integrity goes into all of the above. So you guys are making a commitment to be a high performance person, a high performance athlete. Just because it's not happening on the field, uh, you know, I hold you guys in the same regard as I do any of my teammates who, who stand out here on, on this baseball field with me. So, um, I know I said it in the video earlier, I get, I'm lucky enough to get to call this my home and this my workplace. And the reason I get to do this is because of the commitment you guys are making today and the recommitment that you guys are making. Um, the sacrifice, the dedication to our country, uh, fighting for all of our rights, all of our freedoms, everything that um, our four founders have fought for before us is um, allows people like me to be able to do all those things that I get to do in the community and, and to have a day in LA called Justin Turner Day. That wouldn't happen without you guys. So I want to thank you very much. Um, I want to welcome you uh, into this first step of your journey. And I want to uh, send out prayers and best wishes on, along the way and, and hopefully um, you know, you'll be the ones making a huge, huge impact on our country and our future. So congratulations and thank you very much.